most facile, superficial prime minister that's ever been. Mm. He just shoots from the hip, you know. He says, right, um, first of all, he was going to decrease immigration to tens of thousands. It's mm. now higher than it's ever been. Mm. And he shouldn't have said that because he actually doesn't have the means to control it. He's, he's, he makes these one-off commitments and he gets no, he, he just can't do anything. He, he can't deliver on them. That's stupid. Mm. He, isn't, he isn't a good prime minister. Boris is a joke. He he plays well. He plays well in London the same way that Ken Livingstone plays well in London. Because they, yeah. like, because they like a cheeky chappy. But oh. you can you can you present Boris Johnson in sort of Preston, in Birmingham, in Manchester? No, they just think he's a he's so you know. Um, he he is he is. Uh, public school, uh, upper class twit. I think he went really seriously wrong towards the end. Mm. That's not. Um, well, Iraq was a problem. Um, Why did he do that? Because he fell in love with George Bush. He makes lots and lots of money. He's a crap artist, awful. But he was very much under the influence of his vice president, a man who was a big oil executive. Mm. That had been, he was the head of Halliburton's. on all the reconstruction money that would have to be spent and getting into the Iraqi oil fields. Well, one thing called Sewell Motions as well. They were replaced, they were called Legislative Consent Motions by Mr. Alex Summond, who couldn't bear getting up and moving Sewell Motions because oh. he doesn't like I saw him on the flight. He was crazy. This pratty was sort of holding court. He was walking up and down the aeroplane saying, Hello, hello. Oh, how are you doing? Hello, hello. Everybody calling me Alec. We probably make a creep. Oh.